So, it's been... what? Let me check. Yeah, I've been really inconsistent. Today, I'm gonna be looking at cubes that I can't afford to buy. So this can range from like a YJ Guanlong, that's like three bucks, to whatever that crystal cube is, that's 600 bucks. I made a video on it, so go check it out in the iCard. I have some items that I wish to get from the two big North American cubing stores, SES and the Cubicle, of course. And let's start off with some cube mats. For cube mats, it's just SES, because to be honest, they have better design on whatever these cubicle ones are. They're more creative. I like them better. Like, look at this undead mini mat. I can't see it. It's $1.73. That's a pretty cheap mini mat. That's like, what, $2 in Canada? I also like this Cosmic V2 mini mat. I want a cool little mini mat, but at the same time, I don't want to betray the iconic blue mat I have in most of my desk videos. Ooh, look at this Cube Solve Hero mini mat. It's also on sale. Yeah, I still can't buy it, and that's why I'm doing this video. It's just nice to window shop sometimes. Next up, we have GAN 3x3s. Look at this. Look at this GAN 12 maglev. Oh, looks so good. Wait, I know they actually made UV cube. What? I thought they discontinued that. GAN's always trying to find a way to take our money, am I right? But seriously, so expensive. $70 plus for the flagship? Oh, I mean, the GAN duo's on sale at the cubicle. I guess the duo is on sale everywhere. The cubicles discounts just a tad bit better though. I may consider picking up a, a GAN 11M duo. We have GAN Megaminx. I don't know if you guys can see this well. I have no like viewfinder, but this is a Yoohoo. I don't really do Megaminx too often, so even if I want it, I probably won't use it if I get it, <laughs> which means I'm not gonna get it because that'd be an irresponsible purchase. I'm good with my money. I would invest it all in Dogecoin. You know, GAN should make their own cryptocurrency. Ooh, the cubicle actually has discounts on all of them before discount codes. I'm not gonna say anyone's discount code to not offend anybody. If you wanna collab, hit me up. Uh, I'll insert your discount code in my next videos or something. My DMs are open. Now I wanna look at the AI cubes and smart cubes. So the Rubik's Connected kinda want one because of the Red Bull World Cup. Did not realize they discontinued Geiger cubes. I don't know when that happened. What? Wait, this one was 15 bucks? What? Oh, it's because it's it was not electronic. Rubik's Connected would be my first choice. Kind of want to compete in the Red Bull World Cup. I'd be able to make a video for you. <laughs> Is this like a, an AirPods case for GAN? What? The Power Pod. This is legitimately an AirPod case, but for your smart cube. It probably only, yeah, it, on, it only works with these GAN cubes. Like, <laughs> oh, there's a secret message at the bottom. Highlight it and you see it. Secret message on the cubicle. I don't know if that means anything, probably not. Of course, GAN makes a battery bank for a smart cube. Like, it's a GAN move. Next up, I wanna look at a new release. I wanna look at the Tornado. The Cuber's home one, I've heard better than the other one, like with the magnetic core. I don't know, there's not really much to look at here. I've watched enough videos to know that this one's stable and the other one's not stable. I don't know, some people really like it, some people don't. I wouldn't want to buy it, but I do want it. That's why I'm looking at it in this video. You guys are probably thinking that this is like a Reddit reaction level of effort of video. Absolutely zero, zero effort. I'm gonna try to edit as much as I possibly can. Let's look at the lube's right now. SES, they changed their bottles. I'm not sure when, but they changed it. I kind of like the old ones, not gonna lie, but it is what it is. But the ultimate lube bundle, 30 bucks. I think that says 28 or 6. I don't know. I have glasses on. I can't see. I think I'd get it in 15 milliliters. Oh my gosh, that's 90 bucks normally? Holy. Oh, I can't believe, I can't believe premium lubricant's that expensive. I, I'm not sure what goes in it, but. So let's look at 
the cubicles premium lube. They have a lot of lube. I think I've watched videos on like all of them. Ooh, I didn't know that DNM7 came in red for the holidays, so. The cubicle has their lube prices still at $4.99. Unlike Speed Cube Shop, they had to raise it to $5.95 US? What? <laughs> if I were to buy a premium lubricant, it would be from the cubicle.com. Hey, Speed Cube Shop, if you want to sponsor me, emails in the description somewhere. Like, I haven't bought any lube from the cubicle. For my first lube, I think I would get DNM37 because it's a really fast lube. I guess I can put in a big cube or a mega mink, so yeah, I'd get good use out of it. Or I'd get okay use out of it. I don't want to put in my WRM, but I don't know, they just have a lot here. The next thing I'm gonna look at are the MGC cubes. I'm gonna look at the MGC 4x4, 6x6, and 7x7 because I do not have those. I have the 5x5 right here. This is the 5x5. I, I like it quite a bit. Let's do a Y perm. But look at this YJMGC 4x4. I don't get why they still sell 4x4s and big cubes and stickers. The, the stickers are just gonna peel off, okay? Well, this is the MGC 6x6. Looks like they don't have the same images as the 4x4. You know, I feel like I could take these types of photos. I have my beautiful light right here. I have my phone. I have, like, paper and, like, cardstock or something. Amateur photographer for a cube store. I'll do it for free for any cube stores who want to hit me up, you know? Yeah, I would do photography for free, like, product shots for any cube company. I just need the cube. I don't really feel like looking at the 7x7. Let's finish this video off with some very special cubes. Timon's Waylong WRM. I'm pretty sure he uses it in Monkey League. He uses it in competition. Oh my, look at these continental records. He's, he's gone to so many comps, and I'm still waiting for my first one here. My first one in a long time. I wonder if it has a disclaimer that this cube won't make you as fast as Timon. Nope, it does not have the disclaimer in the description. But Maddie's Gan 11M Pro. Oh wow, they can't remove the GAN logo from soft coated plastic? I would have thought they would have like found a way, but you're still getting a really good product. Of course, Maddie Hiroto Naba, another very fast cuber. There's been a lot of promotion for this last one. This last one may be the most popular out of all. However many this one might be the most popular out of all 10 of the Cubicles Signature Series cubes. It is because I'm sorting by best selling, but that is the cube head. Yo cube. Look at that. Look at this product shot. They put a little glow onto the cube in Photoshop. Oh, cube head made a full video on it. And then there's just so much chatter in the cubing community about how good it is. Makes me want one and relatively cheap in comparison to the other Signature Series cube of course i will be unable to buy it man i want i want this cube the yo logo looks very clean as well if you're wondering where all the pyraminxes are um i don't want pyraminx because pyraminx is a joke those are all the cubes that i want but can't have so yeah i'm gonna have to keep dreaming you know just like i keep dreaming for you to hit the subscribe button on my channel and the like button on this video that was pretty smooth that, that was pretty smooth you have to admit okay just just click one of these side videos, please. Thanks for watching. Bye. Peace.